What's going on guys? My name is Zach Sensham and welcome to the channel. So today we got something new for the car, something I've been excited about, something I've really wanted since I got the car, but it was never made. It was never a production thing for my car. So I'd actually talked to somebody about doing a custom carbon fiber, one-off hood. During the process, it got released. It got production by BMC Extreme Customs. Now it's not carbon fiber, but it is if I'm not mistaken, the third production hood period since it's been released, and I know the first two people that ordered before me. Now, today we are gonna be unboxing this. It is their Hornet heat extraction hood or something, AKA it's the Viper replica hood. Center intake, three heat extractors on each side. And behind me, this is the box. This is how it came shipped. And the box is undamaged, everything, so we're gonna see how well it's packaged inside so you guys can see exactly how you would be getting it if you ordered it. And then we're just gonna take a look at it, see how much prep work it is. And I'm over here with my man, Chindo, working hard, playing on his phone. Uh, he's a guy that I've been helping out at his shop. He does a lot of custom work. I've been doing a lot of paint and body prep work. So of course we're gonna be getting the hood prepped here and on the car after we work on customer stuff. So, you ready? We'll see how this thing, uh, see how it's packaged. Good, all right. Good. just kind of sitting in there well that I don't like too much so uh, it looks like it had some styrofoam on each corner but no damage no damage doesn't look like any of the corners are damaged I know they were actually in there pretty well Get a look at it from. Whew, that thing's looks minister. I like it. I'll see how the. Oh, you got it. All right. So hard to tell exactly. It mark. actually, it looks pretty smooth for a mold. You know, actually, I never thought about it. It's actually it's one of the first molds, so it hasn't had time for their actual mold to kind of get worn from multiple uses. Mm -hmm. Never thought about that. Yeah, that's actually pretty straight. Looks pretty straight. Won't know until we actually block it and get it ready. Um, we got something I can set it down. I was going to show them the underside of the hood. Sure. So these are actual functional. So this intake has a tunnel that goes to the factory air box. Well, you'd have to have an aftermarket air box and these heat extractors are actually functional too. Oh well, shit, now you're doing all the work. <laughs> so as I was saying, this intake. Come on actually, trim and cut it yeah, out. we gotta trim and cut it out. So this intake, you'll see it tunnels to right here, which is where the, this would be the, Airbox. yeah, I'm trying to think. I'm not looking at it and it's upside down. Yeah, driver's side. And then these heat extractors. Ah, oh, so on my buddies, they didn't, they'd have to either be cut out or they cut it out back here. So it looks like only. That makes sense. Yeah, so it either have to be trimmed out for here or back here, so my buddy's hood, it, he had it cut open right back here. Okay. So all these are tunneled back it's there for the, the for the heat extractor. Yeah. Well, maybe. I mean, I guess I might actually have to look at his, or we're going to have to figure it out. What are you thinking? It's definitely functional for cold air. I just don't know the separator for the heat. Yeah. I'll have to look at pictures of his and see. I think I got pictures underneath the hood, but... We'll have to check that out and see where all these, you can for sure see that they kick up. 
but even the mold on the back side doesn't look bad. Yeah, it doesn't look that bad. So there shouldn't be too much prep work, we're thinking. Hopefully, my man Chindo is the painter here, so I just like to help out and unbox stuff and do all the prep work. If he says there's not a lot of prep work, hopefully there isn't. I'll be doing another video once we start doing the prep work on it and we getting it ready. We test fit it on the car. We'll make sure that it lines up properly. I just did, I didn't drive my car today and the box came in today and we had to open it. I had to get you guys a YouTube video because no one else, uh, I can't say anyone else. One other person has this hood. It's on, it's installed, it's painted. He's here in DFW. I know who he is. He's my man, Tony. I'll have to get him to come up here and we'll get the cars together. My other buddy, Jamie, ordered one himself. I don't know if I'm supposed to say it, but anyways, Jamie, you're out there. His hasn't been delivered yet, so I had to get a video for this. Well, stay tuned. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up if you like the video. Man, and then just, if you wanna see this on the car, you wanna see it functional, you wanna see it test fitted, you wanna see everything on the process for this hood, stay tuned. I'll have a video for that coming soon. Also got more stuff for the car coming soon and we'll see you guys in the next video.